Hi, my name is Catherine Ramos. I am the vice chair of the Puerto Rican Civic Club of San Jose. And this evening we have gathered together to remember those who have lost their lives in Hurricane Maria. Um, today marks the one year anniversary of this tragic event that happened in Puerto Rico. And we are in the process of having conversations about what still needs to happen. Puerto Rico has gone through a very devastating ordeal and they're still struggling, they're still suffering. Each week we receive phone calls and communications about people who are still in need of help, who don't have water, who don't have electricity. They may have electricity for three days and then the electricity is gone again. So this is affecting the quality of life. This is affecting food being kept um, in the proper conditions so that it doesn't spoil, um, clean water. So these issues continue to happen even a year after Hurricane Maria. So ourselves and 10 other organizations throughout California collaborated with Puerto Ricans in Action of Los Angeles and we came together to do this vigil across California to have conversations and talk about what's still going on and to remember those who have lost their lives and shed light on the situation that is still occurring in Puerto Rico. The death toll has reached over, well over 2,600 people and this continues to happen and our people continue to suffer. So we're out here. If you want to get in touch with us and see how you can be of more assistance, please go to our website. Our website is www. Puerto Rican Civic Club.org. That's Puerto Rican Civic Club.org. Or check us out on our Facebook page, Puerto Rican Civic Club. And you can reach us there, send us a message, and we can use all the help we can get. And we're still looking for monetary donations. So please share this information with friends, family, different companies that might be willing to still help. We're still building roofs. Our goal is to raise $10,000 a month so that we can go out there and help some people rebuild their lives. Thank you.